Pythagoras theorem. In a right angle triangle, the square on the hypotenuse is equal to the sum of the squares on the sides containing the right angle. Given ABC is a triangle with angle BAC is equal to 90 degrees. To prove that, BC square is equal to AB square plus AC square. Construction On AB, BC and CA as sides, describe squares ABFG, BCDE and ACKL respectively. Draw AMN parallel to BE, meeting BC at M and DE at N. Join FC and AE. The proof of the theorem is as follows. It is given that angle BAC is equal to 90 degrees. Angle BAG is equal to 90 degrees since it is one of the angles of square BAGF. Therefore, angle BAC plus angle BAG is equal to 180 degrees. Therefore, CAG is a straight line. Angle ABF is equal to angle CBE, since they are angles of squares and hence each angle is equal to 90 degrees, adding angle ABC to both sides. Angle ABF plus angle ABC is equal to Angle CBE plus angle ABC. This means angle CBF is equal to angle ABE in triangles CBF and ABE. BF is equal to AB since they are sides of the square BAFG. Recall angle CBF is equal to angle ABE that we had proved earlier in the proof. BC is equal to BE since they are sides of the square BCDE. Therefore, triangle CBF is congruent to triangle ABE by SAS congruency. Therefore, triangle CBF is equal to triangle ABE. But, triangle CBF is equal to half square ABFG since they have the same base BF and are between the same parallels BF and CG. Triangle ABE is equal to half rectangle BE and M since they have the same base BE and are between the same parallels BE and AN. Therefore, BE and M is equal to square ABFG since triangle CBF is equal to triangle ABE. Similarly, rectangle CD and M is equal to square ACKL. Therefore, BE and M plus CD and M is equal to square ABFG plus square ACKL. This means square BCDE is equal to square ABFG plus square ACKL. Therefore, BC square is equal to AB square plus AC square. Thus, we have proved the theorem.